Did you know the Sheps microphone is most powerful when recording dialogue indoors? Did you know the Sheps microphone is industry standard for filmmakers? My name is Jeffrey, I'm a professional sound mixer, and today we're gonna to be reviewing the Sheps cardioid condenser microphone. So what makes this microphone so unique to carry such an amazing sound? Well, to start off, this microphone has an amazing sound capsule. The sound capsule this microphone uses is the MK41. I know it sounds like a type of gun, but the capsule to this microphone is the reason why it's able to capture such a great sound. The Sheps microphone is a cardioid condenser microphone, so it's not unidirectional where it picks up what's directly in front of it. It picks up what's around it. So if I happen to move around the microphone like this, you can still hear my voice pretty clearly, and it's pretty amazing. I've been using this specific microphone on the set of an independent feature recently. It's called Hellhounds. You can check out the Hellhounds IMDb page in my video description. But I've been using this microphone to record indoor dialogue between several actors when it comes to two shots, when it comes to one person talking or multiple t people talking on the screen. And this microphone does such a great job with capturing crisp dialogue. So for example, if there's a wide shot going on and I'm trying to get as close as I can to the actors and there's two of them speaking at the same time, Usually if I were using a unidirectional microphone, I'd have to focus the direction of that microphone towards that one person's lips. But with this cardioid condenser microphone, I can capture two voices very clearly. And again, that's because this is a cardioid. It captures what is around the microphone. Same, you can still hear the same quality. Compared to if I were to use a unidirectional condenser shotgun microphone. And unidirectional condenser shotgun microphones have sound tubes that reject sound from the side. So unidirectional microphones are best used for when recording dialogue or anything outdoors. They do a great job of rejecting sounds like the wind or traffic or let's just say a, a storm coming in. Pretty much the unidirectional microphone does a great job with rejecting any noise that's surrounding it and focusing directly on what's in front of it. So the Sheps microphone comes in a wooden box. Inside the box you'll find the microphone and you'll find the windscreen that goes along with it. This windscreen in a sense acts like a pop filter and what pop filters do is minimize the amount of airflow that goes into the microphone. So let's say you're listening to your favorite song. I know a song that I recently covered for my music channel was Olivia Rodrigo's Good For You. I used a pop filter when recording my vocals because I didn't want as much airflow to go directly into the microphone and with the microphone you'll also get a nice amount to place on your mic stand. But yeah overall this microphone is such great quality and I know the price is high but in the end if you're looking to upgrade the quality of your audio because you're an independent filmmaker you're looking to make more films or looking to sing more or whatever the reason for buying the microphone, this microphone is a great investment for recording indoor dialogue. Let's say you want to record voiceovers. Let's say you're an actor and you're looking for a nice microphone that picks up great sound. This microphone will do the job. This microphone connects to your audio device via XLR cable, so make sure that you're putting the female end into your microphone and then connecting the male end into your mixer. For me, I use a Zoom F6 when mixing my audio, but I'm looking to get a mixer pre-6 pretty soon. But yeah, that pretty much covers the gist of this amazing microphone. If you guys have any more questions regarding the Sheps microphone, then please feel free to comment down below any concerns or questions you have. Again, the independent feature I'm working on right now is called Hellhounds. It's directed by Robert Conway, and you can find the link in my video description. So I've been doing a lot of talking about the Sheps cardioid microphone, but I've also talked a little bit about unidirectional microphones and the sound difference. Let's compare the sound difference between a Deity S Mic 2 unidirectional condenser shotgun microphone and the Sheps cardioid condenser microphone. Alrighty, so here here I have my DDS Mic 2 condenser shotgun microphone, and here I have my Sheps condenser cardioid microphone. Now let's listen to just the DDS Mic 2. I am talking directly into the DDS Mic 2, as you can hear my voice and my distinct articulation talking directly into the DDS Mic 2. This microphone is a condenser shotgun microphone with sound tubes that reject sound from the sides and primarily focus mainly on the voice coming directly from the front of the capsule. Now I am talking towards the Sheps microphone. This is a condenser cardioid microphone, which means it has more of a round pickup. And what makes this microphone so unique is its capsule, the way it captures sound. It doesn't capture it in a unidirectional direction. It captures it from side to side. So if I were to move right here, then you can still kind of hear my voice as I'm moving along around the microphone. Compared to the DADS Mic 2, if I were to speak to it right now, but if I were to move around the DADS Mic 2, you would not hear the same quality and articulation from this microphone compared to if I were to be talking to the Sheps microphone. 
But yeah, this Sheps microphone is a great investment. I mean, I'm speaking to the camera lens right now, even though the microphone is right here. If I were to speak right here directly to it, obviously there'd be some sound difference, but because I can still speak in this direction, right over here, it's still picking up my voice pretty clearly, and um, it's just one hell of a great microphone. I hope you enjoyed this video and got a lot more understanding about the Sheps microphone. And I also hope you have a better understanding of whether or not you wanna buy the Sheps microphone. And if you do wish to purchase this microphone, then definitely check out the link in my video description. And there you can also find a link to the DDS mic too. If you guys haven't already, please be sure to hit that like button and subscribe because there are gonna be more awesome videos about film production and audio coming from Jeff Makes Films. Thanks for your time and I'll see you in the next video.